Hey everybody, welcome back to CS125. This week is our last, the last week of kind of the first unit uh, in this class where we talk about imperative programming, the basic building blocks of computer programs, and the basic sort of uh, ways that we access core computer capabilities, like the ability to store and work with data, repeat things, make decisions, and stuff like that. Starting next week, we're going to enter a new um, part of the course where we're going to talk about uh, Java objects and a different way of sort of organizing uh, state and behavior within our programs. Um, we'll also have your first midterm uh, next Tuesday as well. So today's a week, uh, today, this week is a week to sort of finish up, um, wrap up any loose ends that might be lying around from the first part of our journey together, um, and, you know, get you prepared for the midterm. So um, a couple of announcements are kind of important. So uh, Wednesday this week is one of these instructional off days this semester. So we will be off. That means that the course is offline. Um, you know, there will be no office hours. There'll be no help side hours. There'll be no lesson. There'll be no homework problem. Um, there'll be no me, you know, talking to you through the inner tubes. Um, nothing. So uh, I'm sure some staff members just out of force of habit will still wind up on the forum. And so maybe you can find some people to answer questions there, but don't count on it because this is one of our days off. You know, we don't get a spring break this semester. Instead, we just get these three little crappy days interspersed throughout the semester. So we need to take them when they're here and really, you know, try to take them as an off day. So I would encourage you to do that, you know, rest, relax, enjoy a day off from not having to think about computer science and come back like slightly fresher on Thursday. So that's what's happening on Wednesday. Um, tomorrow you have a quiz. I want to remind you that there are, there were CS Voices articles that were on Saturday's lesson. So please don't miss those as you prepare for today's quiz. Sorry, today you have a quiz. I always forget. I'm doing this Monday, but we're talking about Tuesday. So you have a quiz today. Good luck with that. Um, enjoy today's lesson. This is a chance to kind of look a little bit more at how Java works and gain a little bit of a deeper understanding of what's actually happening when your program runs. And this will help you, I think, understand a little bit better how to deal with errors and how to uh, sort of handle some of the common problems that you run into when you're, when you're working with your Java code. So have fun, and I will see you when you're done.